Well, hey, welcome back to Movie Community College. I am the professor. How are you? I want to talk to you about X-23. X-23 is a possibility for the newest Wolverine film. Um, I'm a big Wolverine fan. I've always been a big Wolverine fan. I will continue to be a big Wolverine fan. I will make the X-Men great again. Um, I just watched some Donald Trump stuff. I'm sorry. Um... X-23 is the daughter of Wolverine, kind of, in a sense. And there's speculation that on, on what's going on in their, in their version of Old Man Logan, there's a little girl with him that it's going to be Laura Kinney, who is this kind of, you know, what would you say? She's not the, she's not the traditional daughter of Wolverine, like Wolverine, you know, uh, got married and had a baby. But I, I believe she was cloned from his genome and uh and, and possesses a lot of his same qualities uh, she has the adam antium you know coated bones and she has claws that come out like wolverine but she also has claws that come out of her feet too which is a little bit different and uh, she was created to be really kind of the perfect killing machine and she was uh, an assassin for a while with what were they called what they called facility I think they were called Facility. And through a, a series of tragic events, um, she eventually comes across Wolverine and the X-Men, and she attends the X-Mansion and becomes a member of the X-Force. Now, there are different kind of representations of her. We see her in the all-black, but there's also one <clears throat> that, that she is... Um, She's in the Wolverine costume, which is kind of cool. And so here you, you have, I think, an opportunity where you can introduce a kind of female Wolverine one-off, maybe. I don't know. I mean, because with Hugh Jackman kind of going into retirement as Wolverine, and you think about that, for the last 20 years, that's all we've known as Wolverine is, is Hugh Jackman. I think it would be kind of cool to see Laura Kinney kind of come on the stage and be this mutant clone Um you know, and uh, step in for a period of time until X Men recast Wolverine, or maybe she'd be. You know, it'd be maybe you could do it as like a Netflix series or something. You know, where you could get kind of, kind of crazy violent with it and whatnot. Now, some of her abilities, she's very proficient in martial arts and long range weapons and explosives. So she has a very tactical kind of side to it. She's got superhuman strength, speed, reflexes, and endurance. She has the kind of Wolverine senses of smell and sight. She regenerates just like her father does. And we talked about the retractable claws in her hands and feet, which is kind of a little, a little bit of a, um, a uh, you know, change from Wolverine. Now, some stories that you can go look for in your comic store and learn more about her are, are the Innocent Lost, Target X, NYX. Uh, which is kind of an interesting one. Um, and then she is in X-Men, too. Um, I, I would really like to see this character, I think. I'm not I'm not a real big uh, let's kind of replace the characters. But, um, boy, I think this, this would be a lot of fun to kind of see the female, you know, the daughter of Wolverine look out. It'd be all crazy, wouldn't it? Um, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to our channel. That way you can stay up to date on all the latest videos. I'll catch you guys later. Peace. And hair grease. Da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba.